on the corner, gave me a false what ticket. Were you doing, what were you doing a few minutes prior to that? I was at Home Depot. That's a lie, okay? That is not a lie. Are you with you about this? I'm no, no, no. Look, you can say that I was parked there, but I never was. So if I turned my vehicle around or something like that and had slowed down on the other side, that's not parking. So, and he also can't write me a ticket for that because he wasn't present for that. You can go back and forth about this for hours. Uh, the surveillance video kind of speaks for itself. Okay. So, well, just remember, I told you you were being recorded the whole time, and I'm going to make sure that this, this recording gets out as well. Okay. All right, I'm letting, I'm letting the world know that I believe that you are corrupt. You changed the number or someone at your office did because you're saying you have a copy of the same form with a different number. All right, is there anything else I can do for you? Sure, you can unfalsify this ticket because That's we all know that it's a lie. And, you ha- and unless you guys are going to show proof to the world, I'm the only one showing proof. We're not obligated to show proof to the world. Yes, you are. Else? Yes, you are. I paid for the ticket and I need to see what I'm accused of. You can't, you can't just make up a ticket and then say, yeah, we have footage of it, and then not show it. I'm asking as a citizen to see it. I'm going to make sure that you guys show it to me. I'll have my lawyer get it. I promise you, this is like a multi-million dollar lawsuit against the city. All of this. And then if you don't take it serious, you'll be part of it. There won't be immunity for corruption. You have my name and serial number. I sure do. I sure do. If you don't, I'm going to go. Okay.